All right, so today we're gonna to discuss five different ways to increase your success on the FCLE exam. What's up everybody? My name is Jack and I'm the co-founder of GovDogs. Let's get into tip number one. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is use official study materials. Utilize official study guides and practice tests from the Florida Department of Education and other reliable sources. These materials are designed to align with the test format and content and will set you up for success on the test. Because I like you guys so much, I took the original State of Florida study guide for the FCLE exam and I made it better. As you can see, all competencies are addressed and organized to maximize your study time and effectiveness, which makes our FCLE toolkit a must have as you prep for the exam. Also, subscribe so you don't miss our FCLE masterclass coming soon, where we sit and discuss each competency start to finish once and for all. Tip two, you're gonna to wanna to create a study schedule. Develop a study schedule that allows you to address every single content area in a reasonable amount of time. Consistency is key. So allocate specific times per day or per week for study sessions. Don't try to learn all competencies at once. Slow and steady wins the race. Before we move on to tip number three, let's get something straight. The official FCLE study guide is broken down into six sections or competencies, averaging 15 topics per section. Let's assume it takes you 10 minutes to find, research, and address each topic in each section. Based on that math, it'll take you 900 minutes to complete the official FCLE study guide. Now, obviously, this isn't going to be an issue if you have a spare 15 hours in your busy week. But if you're like the rest of us, chances are you don't. Downloading free resources such as ours can help you manage that study time more efficiently. Tip three is the double R's, review, and revise. Periodically, review the material that you previously covered to reinforce your knowledge. Use flashcards, summaries, or self-quizzing techniques to help you retain information. It's okay to not know everything at first, but don't make the mistake of not correcting your errors. If you have flashcards, write down this code. Trust me. All right, on to tip four. Tip four is to get SMART. So SMART is an acronym that stands for Specific, Measurable, Achievable, Relevant, and time bound. Set SMART goals for your study sessions. For example, aim to complete a certain amount of study questions within a certain time frame. This will help you organize information without getting overwhelmed. Today's sponsor is me. I'm the sponsor. Remember that code I told you about? If not, toggle back in the video. If you want to further practice your skills, we also have practice tests for each of the competencies mentioned above. Use the code for $10 off our FCLE practice bundle, which brings me to our next tip. Tip five is to utilize online resources. Explore online resources such as educational websites, forums, and YouTube tutorials to supplement your studies. These resources can offer additional explanations and strategies. Make sure you check us out at govdogs.com. Use these tips, rewatch our videos, and get ready to kick some FCLE. Thanks for hanging out, and I'll see you in the next one.